Hey guys, we're gonna give you a little uh, review today on the Altra Lone Peak. This is Altra's, you know, the whole company, Zero Drop, that's what they're built on. And the Lone Peak is their trail specific shoe. It's got a uh, cushion underneath the foot, but it's still a Zero Drop. But this is a shoe that I have a lot of friends that are getting into some 50 or 100 mile ultra, you know, trail running races. And this is what they're really starting to look at because not only is it zero drop but there is some protection there so it's a little uh, less beating on the body maybe uh, super aggressive tread on the bottom of this thing and wide toe box one thing i'm hearing over and over about the ultra stuff is that yes it's zero drop but it's also very roomy in the toe box so people are finding it very comfortable up there especially if they have a, a flat foot or a wide toe box themselves are fitting into it pretty well so this is the ultra lone peak we uh, got a nine and a half in. One thing to note with the first impressions is that Andrew is actually gonna be testing this. He ordered a size 10 because it said to size up a little bit on the site and he got them and, the, and they were actually really big on them. So he went back down to a nine and a half, which is normally where he's at in, in other shoes. So we'll see what he thinks once he starts running in them, but just test wearing them and trying them on when he got them out of the box, he needed a half size down. So nine and a half would run true not be sized up for him so he's the one that's going to test him uh what what to tell you about andrew he's got super flat feet he's had inserts he's been in stability shoes he's been in neutral cushion shoes and now he's going to be in a zero drop shoe on the trail so you know we got the snow melting the river's probably going to start coming up here pretty soon but we're hoping it melts a little bit more and we can get on the dirt here sooner than later and start testing these out so that's the outro lone peak it's not minimal, I'm not standing here in my underpants, but it is minimal. Cool enough that you can run around town in it, but uh, not crazy enough that you couldn't be uh, caught dead in a restaurant. I don't know if that makes sense or not. Yeah.